I would actually like to be a pro player, which is what I always wanted, and I'm broken inside of them. How many Zayoris could you bench? Two and a half. Apparently you went to Dream League, and when you were told you're on a plane within three hours, is that true or false? That's true. Can you tell us what Okay, I'm here with Lizard and Dota Fit. Lizard, uh, what superhero best describes you? Superman! La la la! Which other Dota talent do you most admire? Which other Dota talent do I most admire? You know... I admire them all. For their passion, for their courage, for their willingness to, to fight for their job, to strive into the unknown, to try and try until they succeed. Good answer. What, what, what career would you love to have? What career would I love to have? I, don't, I actually am enjoying my career right now a lot. And why do you want to be a caster? I did. <laughs> I was. I tried to be a pro player. It didn't work out. And Garrett, I told Garrett, like, listen, boy, I'm gonna kill you if you don't invite me to a event. And he invited me because he was afraid. I guess I don't know. And then I kind of liked it, and I, I started thinking more. And the more I thought, the more I liked the gig. And it's kind of like one of those arranged marriages, you know, it happens, but you, you're not into it at the start, but you, 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 you kind of fall in love as the time goes by. What's the biggest obstacle you've had so far? I don't know what my biggest obstacle was, because I'm obviously, I'm the kind of a guy that when I have an obstacle, I, I do my best and try to, try to go over it. My biggest obstacle, I believe, was the fact that I couldn't realize what my obstacle was, what prevented me from being a tier one player. I guess it's talent, I'm a talentless swine, I don't know. <laughs> what have you learned about yourself from being a streamer? I learned a lot, actually. I learned many things. I learned that, like, I enjoyed entertaining people, but at the same time, I learned that it's very taxing. Like, you can feel super drained after just three or four hours of constantly trying to entertain someone, even though you don't see him, even though it's only like some random people that you, like, I mean, not random, the viewers that you aren't really connected to, right? So that's what I learned. And the second part is that you have to stay to, true to yourself. If you aren't true to yourself, no matter what you do, you aren't going to be happy. In Dream League... That's just deep right there. I know, I hit you with that. I, I really feel that. Yeah. Apparently you went to Dream League. Yep. And when you were told you're on a plane within three hours, can you tell us what happened? Actually, I was in a game and I was playing Phoenix. I was defending versus Mega Creeps. And OD Pixel just shows up in my chat and he's like, Listen, Lizard, can you come to Sweden? And I knew the Dream League is in Sweden at that point. And I'm like, Fuck yeah, bring me, you know? And I'm like, when? What? Give me more details. And he's like, Yeah, bro, like, right now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, what do you mean right now? I'm playing. I'm basically playing in chat, looking at the chat at the same time, trying to defend Mega Creeps and defend myself versus OD as well. And he's like, yeah, here we go, this contact. He's giving me the contact of the guy. And he's like, yeah, your plane is like in two hours. I win versus Mega Creeps. I take the fight. I go to Sweden. And we had a really good time here as well. It's, it's a really nice story. Um, if you had to name your fan club, what would you call them? The Full Device Squad. What was the most hurtful comment a fan gave you? So recently I get, I get this guy, he adds me to Instagram and he tells me this Listen man, I'm not a hater, but I hate your voice and your analysis is shit uh, so that, That's the latest one, I don't think it, 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 I'm not certain if it was the most hurtful one But I can't remember which one broke my heart most Sorry. Where was the, What was the best comment? Uh, there was a thread on Reddit about me and people were really like liking my analysis and that's it That, that, that one I'll remember like from, from, the, from the dream league actually what was your career highlight so far? Dream League Major, definitely. Like, Dream League, Dream League Qualifier was the best for me. And then it allowed me to get into the Major as well. And now I have another Major and the Minor here behind us. So, I'm just... Yeah, beyond words, I'm having a great time. What's, last question, what do you love most about the Dota community? <laughs> what I like the most about Dota community is that I'm like... Probably in the one percentile when it comes to bench press and like squats and uh, like I'm strong. I'm strong for for Dota community standards. That's a stupid. <laughs> Thank you, Liz. <laughs> bye bye.